kids in a farm. We, uh, we've been chasing sheep. It was Harry Pot Roast and he, instead of Harry Potter, Harry Pot Roast. I'm not exactly sure where he got out of. What I did want to show you today is the garden. I just wanted to show you where we're at. You have to start somewhere. Our garden has been getting better every year. When we first started our garden, we had bags of soil and we like ripped open the top and we just like planted in the bags. Stuff grew, but I think the roots were so constricted. I wouldn't recommend that because the fruit that we got from those was like super tiny. I feel like we're getting better a little bit every year. I'm just gonna open this fence and get out of the sheep pen. So, <clears throat> anyway. I'm just taking you guys with me. And here is the nastiness that we're dealing with. I hate this stuff, you guys. This stuff is awful. I call it double grass. It's the double. I hate it. It's everywhere. So anyway, it just comes up everywhere. And that's what I'm working with. It's gross. All right, you guys, don't judge me too harshly, but I have a dream for this garden. All right, we're gonna put a fence up someday. And this is gonna be the fence, the entryway for it. And I wanna paint it green and make it pretty. Then we have our two planters on the side, our two raised beds on the side. And then in the middle, we're gonna just put wood chips down straight rows back. So yeah, that's where we're going to put the, light, the greenhouse. I may just do rows this year, I don't know. One of the greatest things I love about gardening is getting your kids involved because it is so cool to put a little seed in the ground and they can do it with their tiny little hands and, and they get to watch the process of something so tiny turn into this like amazing thing that gives you fruit. The kids love it. They love getting dirty. The garden brings you together. You're bringing, you're bringing people together eventually because when you're picking out of the garden, you can take it to the table and you'll cook straight from the garden. Like, I grew this, it was pretty cool. I love that. Bring the kids into the garden with you because they get to learn about the process and they get to just have fun with you and they get to go check it every day and they get to go check the seeds and they get to see what is sprouting up from the dirt. So it's, it's fun. We encourage you guys to get out there, start planning, don't be afraid of the dirt. You'll find that, you know, you'll learn. It's awesome. Make 
Sasa. Sasa. Is that the thousand head tail? Yep. Charles. He put it on the list, yep. Holy cow, that's big. It's like those leaves in Legend of Zelda. Yeah. Yeah. That's why I wanted to. He wants to grow those. <laughs>